Hey everybody, it's Kevin coming back to you in the backyard hiker. Well, off on another adventure. Gotta be careful when I go though. Put a little ways away today. And I've got uh, some extra drinks with me. So, I see you when I get there. Turn and it is done. This is my camp with my Eno hammock. A gold armor tarp uh, on my on my ground lay here. I haven't decided if I'm gonna do a, an under quilt or my sleeping bag and pad. This is what I got. This is what I'm looking at. It's wet around here, there's cars. Oh, and the train tracks are that berm right there, that gray line that you see. And with that being said, since I had to do a lot of clearing out, I'm gonna try this beverage. It is apple cider. To you, Uncle Hugh, up, down, all around, touch the lips, and slam her down. Very sweet. Very sweet. I guess I'll find out in a little bit. If this doesn't work, I do have a backup. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to sit back, chill. I've had a lot of stuff to hike in, and i got a late start. It is 7.30, not too terribly bad timing. There is wind. Um, rain is possible. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. All right. I'll check back in in a little while. I might have some uh, my nighttime snacks. We'll see what those are all about tonight. All right. And before I forget, I have some shout outs to do this evening. We're gonna start with Outdoor Ting, HP Outdoors, Nicholas Durr, and Survival Sam. All right, everybody. Shout out to you all. The April Challenge, everybody did fantastic. It was awesome to see. I'm back, and I'm hungry again. I had a little bit of dinner earlier, but coming out here, planning to come out here, just kind of like put me, got me amped up, and I didn't want to eat. So today's meal is brought to you by a cup of noodle stir fry. Heart, hot garlic chicken flavor. What's the worst that can happen? It's not going to taste good. That's okay. I still got cookies down here. If you're wondering what they might be, you're going to have to watch and see. Hey, check that out. I rhymed. <laughs> All right. What's going on, everybody? I'm back. Oh, my goodness. And when they said... Uh, hot garlic flavor chicken now i don't know about the chicken part but hot most definitely and i've got a guest here with me that will not go away say hi everybody see him right there they keep coming back they must love me come on go away go 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 it Anyway, so with that being done, I am going to switch over to my most favorite of snacks. Uh -oh. Today, I've got regular Oreos. Fire is not cooperating with me. It doesn't stay lit. And with the wood around here, it just stanks. Stanky. But whatever. 
Anyway, I'm going to eat these cookies. I'm going to have another beverage because that other one was a creeper. Thank you, Uncle Hugh. Anyway, all right. Peace, and I'll check back in with you in a little while. Well, it's about 8.30. Fred doesn't want to stay late. It's been a heck of a week. Two days working on my car. In pain. This is the only solace that I get. No kids. No wife. No work. I'm staying out here tonight. I don't care. My car is about a quarter of a mile, maybe a half a mile away. And to pack this all up is going to take maybe 20 minutes. It's supposed to be get down to about 45 Fahrenheit. I've got my sleeping bag. I've got my under quilt. And I've got a space blanket. Yeah, I'm not going anywhere. I don't care. All right, everybody. I will probably talk to you in the morning. I'm going to relax the rest of the night. The fire is out. It will not stay lit. Oh, well. I might come back at dark. I don't know. All right. Peace. Hey, hey, what is up? Well, it is a quarter after nine, 20 after nine. And if you can't tell, let me douse this. That light that you see back there is the business. Nobody's there. Here's a quick story. The place that I was attempting to going, attempting to stealth camp, uh, as of last year, they added a whole bunch of no trespassing signs. So after sitting there for about 5-10 minutes for that business that was right there, I decided to take a quick walk and notice those signs. With that being said, is when I decided to come more at this current location. I've been to both locations. They, um, it's, um, yeah, it, it, uh, it's really messed up how they work. So, um, yeah, like I said, it's about a quarter after nine, 20 after nine, whatever. It's cooling off. It's still windy. I've got the underquilt on underneath. I've got the pad here. I think I'm going to end up getting the sleeping bag. And sleeping with that as well. I closed up the front of it. I still have the wind coming out the one end. Um, I guess we'll see what happens. As uh, Smith Productions stated, a bad night of camping is better than a great work, great day at work. All right. Peace out. And I'll catch you all in the morning. Well, it's about 5 a.m. Birds are singing. Wish the sun was up though. Yeah. I think uh, I might have to get up now and actually make some coffee. Considering I forgot a spoon for my grounds. Oh well, I'll figure something out. I'll see you guys after I pack up. Very successful night. I slept very well. Really cold. And my sleeping bag, my sleeping pad, and my under quilt. Successful night. All right.
Say after I pack up and adios. Fresh cup of French press coffee. All right, everybody. Yeah, I know this light sucks right now, but the red isn't working on mine. Here, uh, fresh cup of coffee, French press, no instant. Not bad. I don't have my coffee cup today. Too much stuff to bring. So I'm going to sit here, enjoy my coffee, and hopefully the sun will rise. My red light doesn't work right now. I think it's the temperature and the batteries. <laughs> All right, I'll catch y'all in a little bit. An actual sunrise. I'm out. I want to thank you for coming along with me on this stealth camp. Do me a favor, hit that like, subscribe, notification bell, and leave a comment or two. Tell me what you think. It's always good to know. Just so uh, I can improve or whatever the case may be. But. All right, time for me to get out of here, you two. Bye-bye.